Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is the Faceless Sergius and in this video I'll be showing you a walkthrough for the quest, you gotta shoot them in the head. Now this is a pretty long quest and basically the reward is worth it. You'll get the T-51B power armor which is the strongest power armor in the game if I'm not mistaken and in order to start this quest you're gonna have to go to the Museum of History to the underworld and once you're at the underworld do not insult Mr. Crowley or otherwise you won't be able to get the quest and it's actually worth it to uh, endure insults from him because damn the rewards are worth it in any case he can be found at the f nine circles bar or three circles bar or the ninth circle yeah in any case we're looking for Crowley he can usually be found here Let's say mood skin okay if he's not here that's patchwork let's go to Carol's place then there he is what are you looking at Easy now. Easy now, I have nothing against ghouls. Anything to you? Yeah. <laughs> I like it. They don't know or don't care. They were just. And you know what? They think the only way to kill us is to shoot us in the. Hey. Okay, what's the plan? Not everyone is as sympathetic to ghouls as you are. They treat us like zombies. Well, I'm gonna make them pay. Uh, we have to tell a girl something. Well, aren't you? Yeah. Got this list of people. I've only got four guys left on the list. Started out with them. They all deserve to die. But it has to be. I'll pay you. Okay. Excellent. Here's a list of the guys and their last known locations. Where? Bring me back something personal from. Okay. And you start the quest. You gotta shoot them in the head. Now absolutely do not bring him back the keys. Basically what we're going to do is keep the keys for ourselves. And we're just going to kill them. I mean of course you can talk it out and you don't have to kill them. But in any case, uh, the first one which is the closest one is Dukov's place right here. So we're gonna go ahead and go there. In any case, once you're here, go inside the door and you're gonna talk to Dukov. Okay. Who the hell are you? Never mind. Ah. Don't say you might know Mr. Carly, care to comment? Feral ghoul. Why is that he paid me to kill you because you hate ghouls? What? Fuck me sideways! I got nothing against ghouls, ha! Huh? I even had a... This is about the key, isn't it? The goddamn key! Nah. Here, yeah, give me something to prove I killed you. Now, you don't even know what's going on, do you? Now, take it. Okay. You got your god. Yeah. In any case, you can just outright kill him, but I'm not going to do that because I actually like Dukov. He's an interesting fella. What the fuck? Nice, in any case, that's one way to get it. Uh, the other one is all the way over here at the Republic of Dave. We're gonna visit that one next. And in any case, once you appear here, <coughs> Child at heart. Okay, then you're gonna want to talk to Dukov. And I'm not going to kill either one of them. But because I just want to resolve this peacefully, because there are other quests that can be done with these characters. I am Dave. Now. Uh. Are you uh uh, say I'm on vacation. The Department of Tourism. You have 24 hours. We have nothing okay. more to talk about. 
And you let me stay. A donation. A one time. Okay. Yes. So do you know a ghoul named Mr. Crowley? There's a name I haven't. Before the people elected me president, we were part of an expedition. For it. Two of us died, including Crowley. Uh, it's supposed to bring back proof of your death. Alive? I always wondered. Would you consider taking him a personal item? Uh. Mm -hmm. You need all. with only one key. Uh. Mm. Of course. It... Here, take the. Okay. For just speech skills and donating 250 caps, you can do it, or you can just kill him. Like I said, I don't want to kill anybody just yet. In any case, we're gonna go to Rivet City. And this is the third one that we need to visit. The fourth one is well known, in all honesty. It's a freaking ten penny. In any case, if you pass the speech checks and etc. etc. you can actually learn more about the entirety of the situation. Like in any case, we're gonna open this up and we're gonna talk to the trailer. Whoa, uh, my dad. I think dad said he died when. No. Uh, just a hunch. Whoa. See you bleed to death. Uh, sure, dude. Hey. Okay, there we go. No need to resort to violence if I had to change it up a little bit since I'm always killing everyone. Uh, in any case, the last one is all the way over here. Now you know, I already covered the ghoul quest at Tempeni. So you, you now have access to it, or if you blew up Megaton, you have access to it as well. So I'll leave a link of that in the description. In any case, let's open up to the penthouse suites. Good job handling those zombies. Thank you. That's secure for a reason. Uh, What's up? Kill any more zombies lately? Okay. Looks like we'll need to pick the lock. Maybe it's because it's night. I don't know. In any case, you're gonna want to go up over here and talk to How him. Did you get past the? Remember, Mr. Crow. The ghoul. Educated because you hate ghouls. He's alive. Whatever he's paying. Miserable life. Three hundred caps. You one hundred now. Okay. I haven't heard anything about Mr. What's the key now? You're a moron. Okay. Uh. Okay. In any case, that's basically it. And we're not gonna go towards Mr. Crowley. We're gonna go all the way over here, then to the left. In the upper leftmost corner of the map is Fort Constantine. Okay, once you actually arrive at the Fort Constantine, what you're gonna want to do is go to this little shack here called CO Quarters. Okay, once you're inside here, there's a Protectron. Kill him. Kill it. And what you're gonna want to do is head down to the basement. There's just a wastelander, there's a bubblehead, but I'll be covering that a little bit later, you have Ted Strayer's special key, and you get access to this. Now you're just going to go down here, open up this gate. As you can see, there's some ammo here and loot. Then open this door, then go through here. 
So far so good. There'll be plenty of robots here just so you know. And we're actually looking for a body now. We have to get the fourth key so we can actually access the bomb storage uh, for the lols. You can see some nuclear warheads there. In any case, proceed further down. Yeah, to the right here, open this average lock door. There's some more supplies here and loot. And go here. Oh, big book of science. Gotta get that. Okay. And you're basically aiming to go down the stairs. There's a sentry bot. we go even more loot even more stuff and you're gonna keep going down you have the bomb storage you have this door here okay that's very hard very hard and here is Terra storage key and a steam pack open up this door Open this door, and voila, you get a fat man, two mini nukes, a bunch of other stuff, and you get the winterized T51, no, the regular T51 B power armor, and that will complete the quest, and you get the armor. Damage resistance of 50. Damage resistance of 10, Charisma plus 1, Red resistance plus 8, and Red resistance plus 25. One of the best armors in the vanilla Fallout 3, until you actually do the Christian Anchorage DLC, where you get the winterized suit of T-51B power armor. And I actually have no idea what's in here. I just want to see since it's locked behind a very hard lock. Well, a bunch of ammo, nothing important. In any case, uh, that's it.